Good day, guys. Welcome back. Um, so I have not done this video for probably a while because I haven't had really any money to get anything. Um, but today we finally got something, something small, something cheap, and something easy to deal with. And that is this fella. I don't know if you can see it. You should be able to see it. I can see it there. Um, I'm the shorts too. Um, so yeah, basically it's a little um, it's something it's for your phone mostly. You can use this on the Switch, so I guess you can use it on there, which is great. That means I've got four controllers for my Switch. Um, but no, I bought this for the controller for the... This thing. So I can put it on here and stuff like use my Game Pass, um... The Xbox app on here and play games off, off the cloud. That was the whole reason I bought it, but... Well, since we're here, we're better off doing this together. Um, as you can see, it's, it's not too complicated. For the most part, I didn't have it open before, but it looks like it's as usual. When I do a video, it locks up a bit. And I already made a mess of it. Oh well. There we go. I thought I got it that way, opened it, but it will not open. Oh well, whatever. So, guys, as you know, I'm wrapping my stuff. I don't. I don't look forward to the future where I've got to. Like, them off or something in the future so i don't care if i rip it open i mean i know a lot of you guys probably care a bit more than i do i mean in the future i probably should get a knife or scissors or something so i can cut open easily but eh, it is what it is um so far so good it's no damage to it more than i think oh there we go there we go we've got it open we've got it open I'm going to be a bit more gentle than this. Why isn't it coming out? Give me a second. It's coming. It's coming. It, maybe not, actually. Yeah, here he comes. There we go. I just had to get one side out. There we go. Um, That's about it, isn't it? Okay. Let's put the things on the side. Is there anything in it? Uh, it could be, because this looks... Uh, let's see. We've got the controller, obviously. We've got a... another one of these. I've got like a hundred of these, guys. We're getting to a point where I've got so many of them, I could just start selling them off myself. I mean, um, oh yeah, and we've got the little carrying case for it. So we've got this little fella. We can put that in that, that thing in there if I really need to. I could actually use it with my phone as well. But other than that, that was it, guys. That's a bit of a um, receipt top thing in there. Now, I don't know how it works. It's supposed to work for Bluetooth, obviously, but... Um, let's see. Based on its look, it looks... Yeah, basically like a Switch controller. You're supposed to be able to adjust it, so I'm assuming it's like this. Um, you put your phone in. Uh-huh. I don't see how hard that is, actually. There we go. That's it. That's kind of, um... Uneventful, guys. That was really quick and really easy. Doesn't even turn on. Uh, how do you turn off that? Give me a second. I gotta work out how you turn this bad boy on. All right. I'm assuming it's dead. I think it's dead. It needs to be charged, which is unfortunate, guys. Usually, you buy the devices online or something. They usually have a little bit of a charge. But yeah, let me check. Um. I can't find the battery pack where it ever is hiding. Let's move my glasses away because... Oh, let's take this out for the moment. Ow. God damn it. Hit my skin, guys, and it hurt my fingers. Alright, I don't see a spot where you put the charger in, but... The battery pack obviously is here. I don't know where the battery... Oh, ha! Found it! Right there. I don't know if you guys can see, but yeah. Um, we'll just get the charger out and you'll be able to see it once I put the cable in. So I've got the cable out, guys. I'm, actually, this is not a bad cable. It's pretty damn long. I could actually use this for other things. Actually, I can use this for my phone because I lost its charger. Now I've got a new one, I can replace it. Oh yeah, guys, there it is. It goes in here. It's in a weird location. Um, 
That's about it, really. I mean, there's nothing really else to talk about. I can't really use it at this very moment because it's got no power. And I've got to configure my phone for all the Xbox stuff, guys. I have not put any games on it. I was going to set up the um, Game Pass thing on it. Get oh, get the Xbox app sorted out and try it out. Um, my phone's probably not the best fit for it because it's quite a troublesome phone. But it should be enough to give us a try, guys. So, um, we'll probably have a small break. We'll come back. And then we'll finish it up. Okay, guys, um, we're back. Um, I've got my phone finally configured the way I want it. That would not work for whatever reason. It would refuse to be set up. I got it set up. And now you want to move. Um, so you can see, guys, got my Xbox thing on here. All ready to go. I've got my thing in my hand. I'm just going to take it out. So I've got to work out how you turn this bad boy on. I'm assuming it's probably going to be a button called start because it makes the most sense. I think. Hmm. Maybe not. Got to be one of these buttons. Ah, there we go. Home. It was the home button, guys, not start. Alright, let's set it up. I'm assuming now I've got to go to Bluetooth. Probably going to be in here somewhere. Hopefully it's in here. Um, it would be nice to get it configured. Maybe. I'm going to details because it's sometimes sluggish. Um, I start replaying. That's fine. Come on. Why are you saying no other devices? It's weird, it's not working. It's not staying on long enough for it to... Definitely not turbo, definitely not start, so it's this button. Oh, it just keeps turning itself off, the stupid device. How am I supposed to configure something if it turns itself off, dumb machine? Yeah, that's interesting. Uh, what is it doing? Oh yeah, guys, um, so far I'm just having trouble starting this up because, um, unlike a normal device, when you try and connect to it, it usually, you know, connects pretty easily. But this one refuses to. Now, this could be a due to a few things. One, and more than likely what the reason is, is the um, Bluetooth version. I believe the box says Bluetooth 5. I don't know if this phone is 5 capable yet. So, um, let me see if I did see it somewhere. No, it just says Bluetooth capable. Okay, I'm assuming that's not the problem then. Alright, let's assume that's not the problem then. But what is it then? Why are you being a useless piece of shit? So hard to figure. Oh, you dumb phone. Alright, let's take you out. At least it's not turning off. Fucking useless piece of shit. I mean, I turned it on, put the right pin number in, and the phone did not register it at all. Stupid device. Give me a second, guys. I might have to keep pushing the button to keep it online. Now, if that's the case, that's the stupidest thing I've ever seen. There it is. Wireless controller. That is dumb. That is the dumbest thing I've ever seen. It should stay on for like a minute or two. And now I can't connect to it. Pairing, pairing, and went off. Okay, I'm assuming, guys, it can't connect to this phone. Way too old. Even it's not that old. It's only a new one. Uh, it's not new, but it's not old either. I'm assuming it's just because it's a cheap phone. 
So of course it's going to be an attitude problem. So that's really disappointing. I can't really use it. Trying to ping. I can't even put it on the switch because my switch does not work. But yeah, I'm going to rule that out, guys. I don't think it's this thing. It's this thing. This thing's a piece of shit. Um. Maybe I'll just pull down on it and it'll work. I don't know, it just turns off. Yeah, so it's a really weird thing. I expect it to work no problems, but... I don't know why it needs to be Bluetooth 4. I mean 5, sorry. It could be 3 or 4 quite easily. It's not like it's a demanding thing. Oh right, guys, I'm going to just check online, see what's going on with it. Um, this is really starting to become frustrating. Okay, guys, welcome back. Good news. It's freaking working. Um, so this was not the best thing to configure because, um, what happens when you turn it on, the button goes on and it lights up. What I'm doing is I'm pushing it again, trying to keep the lights on, but not realizing the lights are only to tell you it's turned on. So when they go dark, um, it doesn't mean it's off, it just means it's not being used, it's not connected. Um, so what I'm doing is I'm pushing the button constantly, which is turning the, wi the Bluetooth on and off constantly. That's why I had trouble connecting to it. Now, I've worked it out, it's connected properly, and now I'm going to give it a test. So this was on me guys, this was nothing to do with the um, controller. Um, well, I got mixed up with how the um, system works. Normally with like some devices, like my earphones for example, when you turn them on, the, light, the blue light will start flashing, or stay flashing until you connect it. And once you connect it, it changes to another color. Um, or it stays to a solid color, sorry. That's what I was expecting from this stupid thing, but no, this one does not do that. Um, once it's connected, it's fine. Um, but yeah, I just got it back together and it should be alright now. It wasn't the best thing in the connecting part, but maybe its functionality might be the better. I need to figure out my Xbox app. There it is. Look at now, I put the Xbox app right, right at the end. So let's see if it works. I'm going to continue. I've got it sorted out. Let's see if it works. Um. So I'm basically doing two things here, guys. I'm seeing if the controller works, and I want to see if the uh, thing works. Alright, is it connected? Is the device connected at all? Uh -oh. No, it's not. Why isn't it connected? Give it a second to reconnect. Oh, well, here we go. Playing up again. Yep, it's turned off. So now to it again. It should turn back on. Maybe. I don't know. No, it doesn't look like it's working at all now. I think this control might be bugged. It might be the problem. So even though I've got it connected to the um the device, it says it's paired, but it's not. It's just a buggy piece of crap. All right, I could forgive it maybe if I got it wrong and all that, guys. But yeah, I'm not going to forgive it now. It just turns itself off, guys. It's just really weird. Let me check something. Where's my damn fucking button thing? No, oh, it's down here. This is how I turned it on originally, guys. I had to connect it to a power supply. I mean, this is a terrible controller. Even if it did work. 
Oh, well, let's try connecting it to it. I've got a feeling it's not working unless it's connected. So I don't know if that's the controller or what's the um, system itself, the phone. That's weird. Nope, it just stopped working. I'm going to take it back, guys. This is a disappointment. Alright, guys, I'm officially going to take this piece of crap back. I'll get the reset together in order and take it back next time I go down to my shops. Because it is so buggy. It does connect, it just doesn't connect very well. And now it's not connecting at all. Thing. All right, make sure it's in properly because it's not wasn't in. All right, let's try it again, guys. Give it one more shot. If it doesn't work, I'm taking this piece of crap back and probably get money back because there's no way I'm keeping this. Now I thought maybe the um the phone's um Bluetooth version might be the culprit because it's an uh, even though it's a new phone it's an parent phone. Um, the version of this Bluetooth is five point three, so it's not the problem. And the I the Android version is fourteen dot zero, so that's not the problem either because I believe the support is it's thirteen Android thirteen dot zero plus and Bluetooth. Five plus, so but it's not the issue, it's got to be the device itself. Now let's try it again, guys. We're going to go into it and see if it's connected properly now. So, I don't think it's going to work, guys. It's just a piece of shit. This is probably possibly the worst controller I ever tried. I bought online, ever. Oh, not online at a shop. This is the worst controller. Right, I'll wait till it goes off, wait till the lights go off, and then try it again. Hmm. So even when the lights go off, it's, it plays up. When they're on, it plays up. It's just garbage. Alright. Guys, I think I'm going to finish it here. I think you got the idea. It's a piece of shit. Actually, I don't think I should be using that word. Okay, it's not that good. It's it's bad. It's really, really bad of the device. I mean, there are other, other, other ones like this out in the market, but these ones are the cheapest. So I thought a budget one might be a good one to get my hands dirty on it, but uh, it's not going to help if it doesn't work at all. Um, So I'm going to take it back to my local shop, or EV Games, um, closest to me, when I go back to my shopping centre in a few days. And I'm going to throw it at their face because it is a disappointing disappointing controller. Um, now, knowing them, they'll probably give me my money back, obviously, or they'll try to figure it themselves. But, yeah, I have major issues with it, so. Now, it still could be the phone um, as a possibility. I'm actually going to... Actually, that's an idea. Let's go here, guys. I'm going to go into my settings. I'm going to turn my sink off. I'm going to grab my other phone and try that one. Now, that one's much older than this one, so it may not even recognize it at all. Let's go into Bluetooth um, settings. Just destroy this one because it's garbage. Okay. Right, guys, I'm going to grab the other phone. I want to see if that works. If it does work, it might be my phone itself. I doubt it very much, though. Alrighty, guys, I'm back. Um, So, what the... Got the second phone? Um, I just want to know where I put the damn thing. I've had it in my hand. Uh-oh. Not me. I'll probably put it down somewhere without realising it. Um, I'll put my phone down. Um, give me a second. I don't know where I put the fuck... The thing. It's weird. Alrighty, guys. We've got the phone. Another phone. And we've got... This stupid thing connected to its cable. 
Let's see if it works at all. Can I, can I connect to it directly right now? Um, so this is another phone. I don't know what version of Bluetooth it is. I don't know if it's going to show up on here. It might show up on here, but I don't count on it. Um, yeah, so I don't know. I don't think it's the, the, the phone, guys, because there's no way for the phone to do it. I know the price is found. I'll have to turn you back on. Again, again. Huh, okay, it's different. It's got a different name. Connected. Is it? Does it look? Oh, it's connected, guys. So it's connected to this phone. That makes no sense. No, it says it's connected. And I can go back and all. I can actually do it on my phone. It's kind of cool, actually. Let's check. Let's check, seven guys. I'm checking this out on the phone. Yeah, it looks like it's doing nothing. Nope, now it stopped working. Ah, okay. Yeah, I think there's something wrong with this. Not holding a connection at all. Yeah, okay guys, I, I'm ruling this, this is the device playing out, not the phone. Even if it does connect at times, it doesn't hold a connection. It just drops out straight away. It becomes completely useless. Stay on, guys. They're just useless. I mean, what's the point of having a controller if I can't freaking keep it on? It just turns itself off in a few seconds. In a few seconds. Now it's staying on. Okay, guys. It made a liar out of me. Now it's working. It wasn't working because it was connected. So, the question is, why is it working on my phone? On my mum's phone. Looks fine. I mean, it looks perfectly. You can actually, uh, let's see if I can bring it up. There you guys. You can see my phone. You can see my controller. You can tell I'm not touching my phone. But yeah, I can do all this stuff on my phone. On the phone. You can see it moving around. I should take it back home. Nope. Um, I don't know what audio buttons will do, but you get, the, you get the idea. It's working perfectly fine without me um, doing anything. The question is, why is it playing out with my other phone? That's the question. So first I'm going to do is disconnect it. Turn the Bluetooth off. Alright, um, put you back in. So I think you've got to configure it by the cable first. Uh, where's the cable going? Down, down there somewhere. So why is it working on that phone but not working on mine? That makes no sense. So I'm going to rule out this, this, I don't think the device is the problem, um, it's not a very good device, but it's not the problem. So this video was not meant to be 20, I don't know, 27, 28 minutes, whatever it's going to take. Um, now what we do is you turn it on and you rescan, actually I'm going to push the scan now. Oh, see now it's working. What the hell's going on? Oh, it was not working before, now it's working perfectly. And now it's, yep, it's connected directly. I can take this out before it becomes a problem. And now it's working. You know what I think was going on, guys? I think what was happening, 
If it was on cable, right? I think it wasn't charged properly and it wasn't holding a connection because of that. But it's working perfectly now. Um, we're going to try now. Let's go on the Xbox app and see if it works. So this was the giant biggest disappointment I ever had. It's just the worst thing in the world, but it's working perfectly now. Before, it would not even do this. It wasn't connecting properly, so I'm wondering if it was under charge, or maybe I was just doing it wrong. I'm doing exactly the same thing. I haven't changed what I'm doing. Uh, where's my Xbox thing on this side? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, here we go. So we do, yes, I want to do that. Da, 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 da. Okay, open remote play. Yes, I'm aware of it may not work 100%, blah, blah, blah. Alright, guys, you can see it's working. If the light's on, the green one on the side, that one right here, you can see it here. Oh. Yeah, that one, I want to see it here, actually. Look at that, guys. I can actually move my cursor around. That's kind of cool. I'm gonna give it a trial run for a second. Um, let's try a game. Oh, well, let's try good old Minecraft. Oh, not Minecraft, not on this account. I'm trying to figure something out. I don't know. It is pretty slow, this guy, guys. It is very slow up to loading, probably because it's been used and my internet needs a refresh, so it's probably not gonna work very well, but at least we know it works. See, you guys? It's working pretty much fine. Now the question is, how do you turn this bad boy off? I'm assuming this way. How do you turn this off? Well, it doesn't have a bad in turning off. But... Oh, it's fine. Okay. So I finally got it working. I don't know what the hell it's, what was the problem, but it, it's working. Um, when I tried it, yeah, it just would not connect for whatever reason. Now, it's a good possibility because this isn't brand new and I only got it and I believe it was a nearly dead charge. So I'm wondering if it was just didn't have enough power to get set up. But I know some devices do that. They won't work. They won't be able to connect until you charge them up because I hadn't connected for a while. Um, but yeah, let's just give it a shot. Let's go outside on the road and see how it runs. So yeah guys, I'm just giving it a trial run. Oh, what now? Why is it every time I come on this game there's something going on? It's actually relatively quick. It's not perfect. It's definitely, you can see it's flaws, but... Yeah. Um, we're just giving it a nice test. Now let's bring it up to here, guys. So you can see, I'll show you. So yeah, I can't really show you, but yeah, you get the idea. Oh, I don't care about that. Why do I care about the flux and deal? Well, let me see how this runs. Is it playable? That's the question. Uh, it is, but not very good. I think for games that require a lot of input, yeah, it's terrible. I think if the internet was working a bit fast, that would be a much better device. But it is, it's working. So, yeah, okay. I'm going to put it in the past, guys. It passed the test, but it did barely pass the test. The question is, how do you turn this bad boy off? There we go. You just got to hold the button down. And now you push it back on. It works perfectly now. Good. At least we've got it working. So, but yeah, guys, I'm going to be saying, I'm going to be putting a dump on this. It's good, but the configuration was a nightmare. I mean, I don't know why it wasn't configured. I should have charged it up completely before I configured it, but it shouldn't have been a problem. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. This was really annoying. This really pissed me off. This is probably the worst one I've used, but to be fair, it's probably the, it's the first one I've used. So I can't make a comparison, but I do plan to get others and give them a test out. So, hey guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, also, wacky ride. Um, I hope to see you again soon. Cheers.